You know, I ain't gonna. I had the privilege to get to preach my brother-in-law's funeral because I got to talk about salvation. Yeah. Hallelujah. And then I had one of my relatives get mad at me because I didn't preach an hour. My goodness. My goodness. That's why I don't try to please family members anymore. Amen. Come on. But the Lord told me to preach on salvation there, so that's what I did. Yeah. Amen to God. And y'all know me, I, I'm long-winded, so hallelujah. But I want to be obedient to the Lord. Amen. Amen. And I really feel that the Word got planted yesterday, not because I gave it, but because God's Word will not return void. When you send it out, Amen. praise God, He promised it will not return void. So I'm praying for all those people, all my in-laws, amen to God, Come on. that they're going to be saved. Hallelujah. Amen. See, they've heard too much yesterday, Brother Billy. Come on. They can't say they're ignorant amen. of the Word. They yeah. heard too much. And Amen. it was made very plain to him. Hallelujah! Yeah. Gets me excited. Amen? But I thank God for the Word. Come on. Go with me to Jeremiah chapter 37. We're going to have one verse of Scripture tonight. And this verse of Scripture, man, is powerful. Amen? I used this verse yesterday, praise God. Come on. But there, man, I just couldn't get it off the Spirit all day. Amen? How many is happy in Jesus tonight? Amen? Amen. Look at your neighbor and say, smile a little bit. Smile a little bit. Smile like you're happy. Even if you don't feel happy. Because Jesus is alive and well. Amen? Come on. I don't know how you can't be, talk about Jesus and not get happy. I don't yeah. know. Man, amen to God. Brother Billy up here shouting. Amen. Ooh. Somebody think he's full of the Holy Ghost or something. Amen. Yeah, amen. <laughs> Glory to God. Be glad he's filled with the Spirit. Come on. Praise God. Because I tell you, there's preachers out there today, they need that. They need to break past that comfort zone. Amen? Jeremiah 37, 17. Then Zedekiah the king sent out and took him out. And the king asked him secretly in his house and said, Is there any word from the Lord? My goodness. My, my, my. People are asking that today. Is there any word from the Lord? Yeah. I love what Jeremiah says here, Brother Billy. Come on. There is. Oh, come on now. Hey, Jeremiah man. said, There is. How many knows, praise God, there is a word today from the Lord, amen? Come on. For he said, Thou shalt be delivered into the hand of the king of Babylon. Well, that wasn't what he wanted to hear, but I'm telling you, I'm going to go with a different direction in this tonight. Is there a word from the Lord? There is. Come on. Brother Mike, you say, I'm going through hell and high water. Is there a word from the Lord for me? There is. There amen. Is. amen. There is a hope tonight. Praise God. There is a peace tonight. Come on. There is a joy tonight. Whoa. There is victory Hallelujah. tonight in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Come on. So is there a word for me? Yes, there is. Amen. Father, we come before you now in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Oh, the name of all Lord names. Jesus. Hallelujah. <laughs> Father God, I pray tonight, Lord, help us to know that there is a word for us tonight. That it's your word, dear God. Lord God, let our fleshly man decrease and our spiritual man increase, Lord God. Lord God, let us die out to the things of this old world. Hallelujah. And let us be alive to the things of the Spirit, dear God. Lord God, I just pray tonight, Lord, your word would not return void, but it would go out there and minister to those here tonight and those out there by the way of radio, by the way of internet, whatever way you choose, Lord God. In Jesus' precious name. And everybody said, Amen. And Amen. Amen. Is there any word from the Lord? Amen to God. Come on. I'm sure those parents and those people in Connecticut tonight are saying, is there any word from the Lord that can comfort me? It yeah. is. Yes, there is. Brother Billy said earlier, it was expedient that Jesus go away, that He send back the Comforter. The Holy Ghost. Amen to God. Amen. Amen. See, the God we serve, He cares enough about us that He said, hallelujah, I'll send back the Comforter. <coughs> I will not leave you comfortless, he Come said. Yeah. He said, I'll never leave thee nor forsake thee. Yeah. In a time right now, this holiday season, Brother Rodney said it. We need to pray for those in Come the on. jails. Pray for those yeah. in the nursing home. Pray for those who are homeless. Pray for those who are hungry. Come on. Pray for those who ain't got nobody. Yeah. Because it's easy for us because we've got one another. <coughs> we've got family. We've got friends. Come on. More importantly, we've got Jesus. Amen. But there's people tonight as we talk right now that's entering into eternity without nobody. Come on. 
They're committing suicide. Yeah. Because they don't know there's a hope tonight. <clears throat> Come on. They don't know there's a word for them. Yeah. This word, praise God. See, we just don't, you know, hallelujah, we just don't do this because it's the right thing to do or it's something to pass the time. This is a lifestyle right here. Come on. I told a lady today, she said, I was in an office, doctor's office, waiting to talk to one of the, the office managers, and the woman was talking, and she said, I just don't have the faith anymore to believe the Word. She was telling her friend there, she said, I just don't have faith in God anymore because, you know, I've lost everything. I don't have, you know, she lost her husband. She's lost this one and that one. Come on. Her finances, she's strapped, if you will. Yeah. And it couldn't help it. I, and I had to interject myself and I told her, I said, you know, God is. God can set you free from this. She said, I just don't have the faith to believe anymore. How many knows it doesn't take great faith Come to on. move mountains? Come on. He said that. The faith of a mustard seed. And Come on. If we've seen a mustard seed, it's small. She'd given up hope. But thank God for the Word. Come on. She said, how do you know it works? I said, I'll live my life by this book, by the Word of God, by yeah. this Word. Come on. This is all I've got, amen. Amen. He's all I've got. Yeah. There was times I didn't have a dime to my name, Sister Reese, but Come on. Jesus never left me, amen. Amen. There was times I didn't have food to eat, but hallelujah, God provided, amen. Come on. Yeah. There was times I didn't have nobody to turn to, but He never left me. Oh, amen to God. Hallelujah. Is there a word from the Lord? Yes, it is. It's amen true. to God. It's and like true. I told her, I said, you need to get back in His Word. You need to talk oh, to the hallelujah. Lord. Don't abstract and run away from it. Run to Him. Amen to God. Come on. And that's what He's saying right now. Hallelujah. Praise God. There is a word for you. Amen to God. There is a word. Amen <clears throat> to God. You say, Brother Mike, no, 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 there's not. There is. Yeah. There's a word for that rebellious child Come who's on. turned against what his parents are telling him. There's a word for the husband who's cheating on his wife. Come on. There's a word for the wife cheating on the husband. There's a word for the person out there ready to quit ministry. Come on. And the Lord says, keep going. There he is, yeah. Hallelujah. Glory. How many know God is? Amen. You know, I preached a while back out of Hebrews 11, verses 1 through 6, especially verse 6. At the end of it, it says, God is a reward of them that diligently seek Him. Amen, Amen. to God. Amen. How many knows God is? Amen. Amen. God is. If we seek after Him, praise God, He'll bless us. Come on. Hallelujah. There ain't one of us in here tonight oh, that don't have to oh, walk oh, out of here the same way we came oh, in. Oh, I'm telling you, I don't know why the Lord had me to preach this tonight because I had something different to say, but He kept on me. Praise God about it. There is a word for somebody tonight. There is. It's for you. It's for me. It's for them out there watching. Jesus Christ loves you. Amen? Amen. When everybody's turned their back on you, Jesus will not turn His back on you. Amen? Come on. Amen. God wants to help you through your problems. Psalm 121, verse 1 and 2, I love this, praise <clears throat> God, one of my favorites. It says, I will lift up my eyes into the hills from whence cometh my help. My help cometh from the Lord, amen, amen. which made heaven and earth. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Brother Billy asked me to pray for you earlier. Hallelujah, you had a rough day. Your help cometh from the Lord. Come on. I know it's <clears throat> tough, amen, to God. Don't say that. Hallelujah. Me. Please don't. I hope it didn't. I need prayer. I have days where people bite my head off. Come on. Praise God. And I want to bite it back. But you got to love them, amen to God. Come on. I've had times, praise God. I was telling Chris coming up here five years ago, I wanted to give up when I was laying in that hospital bed. Come on. I tell you, when you get slapped in the face with the truth, yeah. it helps you. Come on. And that's what Brother Rad's going through right now. He's going through a woe is me kind of thing. But there is a word for him, praise God. Come on. That he will get up and live, amen to God. I oh, like that word, Brother Billy. Oh, 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 it oh, said, oh, when oh. I saw you polluted in your own blood, dead yeah. and dying, I said, live, yeah. amen yeah. to God. He said, live oh. tonight. He's telling that thing that was dead, live, amen to oh. God. Your broken dream, your promise that you feel like God didn't fulfill, oh. live, amen oh, to God. Oh, live, amen to God. God is, amen to God. There oh. is a word for you. 
tonight. Yeah. How many knows that thy word is a lamp unto my feet? Come on. And a light unto my path. Amen to God. Amen. If you don't know where you're going, it'll give you direction. Amen. amen. I can't get past the hallelujah. Y'all forgive me if I'm repetitious. Oh, amen to God. Hallelujah. hallelujah. I've been preaching that amen for a year and a half now. His word will lead Come us on. and never lead us astray Come or lead on. us wrongly. Amen to God. Yeah. God knows. Amen to God. There is hallelujah. Yeah. There is a word. Amen to God. Glory to God. Sometimes we don't want to hear that word. Amen? Come on. But there is a word. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. I like that song what it says. I remember that song, Have a Little Talk with Jesus. It'll make it all right. Amen? Amen. So I told that lady today, I said, you have a talk with Jesus. Come on. And it'll make it all right. Well, Brother Mike, I don't feel it. Well, we don't go by feelings. We go by faith. Amen Come to on. God. Yeah. Amen to God. Faith is what moves yeah. the hand of God. Faith is what pleases God. When we put our faith into action, amen to God, that's what moves the hand of God. Come on. I mean, oh, there is a word. Amen, amen, amen to God. Amen. Hallelujah. There is a hope. There is a peace. There is relief from the pain we're going through. Amen. Come on. He promised in Revelation 21 4. He said, God shall wipe away all the tears. Come on. He was singing about heaven. What a time we're going to have when we get there. Amen to God. Yeah. It's going to be a whole lot different than it is here. But we can Amen. experience that joy here too. Amen. Hallelujah. I'll tell you, we don't have to be all sour puss and broke, busted, disgusted. I believe Come God, on. Amen. Amen. God, through the Holy Ghost, hallelujah, is wanting us to be joyous, happy, praise God, walking around. Amen. Amen to God. We've got to be a light to a world of darkness. Not to be just like them, amen to God. It's time to stop whining and complaining to God about our problems. And start confessing, amen to God, the word to our problems, amen. amen. Start preaching to our problems the truth, amen to God. There is a, amen to God, there is a word from the Lord for your problems, amen. amen. Brother Mike, you're fixing to go hoarse, that's alright. God will restore my voice back, amen. Come on. I'm going to close out this scripture. I told you I won't keep you long tonight, amen. And I hope this blesses somebody. John 14. My Lord, just thinking about it gets me. So, Brother Billy, hallelujah. I'm sorry. Praise God. Just can't get past it. Amen. Come on. Forgive me, brother, but whew, thy word is a lamp unto my feet and a light unto my path. Hallelujah. If we get that in our spirit, amen to God, and just take his word, hallelujah. My Lord. Hallelujah. John 14, verses 1 through 6. Let not your heart be troubled. If you believe in God, believe also in me. If you've got your Bible, it should be the words in red. Amen? Yeah. That's Jesus talking. He said, In my Father's house are many mansions. Come on. If it were not so, I would have, not, I would have told you. I go and prepare a place for you. Hallelujah. And I love this part. There is a promise. Amen to God. If I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again. Oh, hallelujah. Glory. Don't get discouraged. Amen to God. Read the word. Amen. amen. He said, what is it, 1 Thessalonians 4, 18? Wherefore, comfort one another with these words. Amen to God. And if you read the verses above that, that's where it's talking about the Lord himself will descend from the heaven with a shout and with the voice of the archangel. Amen. Come on. The dead in Christ will rise first. Amen. Then we which are alive and remain will be caught up together. Yeah. To meet the Lord. Amen. Yeah. He says, Well, I will come again and receive you unto myself, that where I am, there ye may be also. Amen. Amen. And whither I go, ye know, the way ye know. Thomas saith unto him, Lord, we know not whither thou goest, and how can we know the way? Come on. Jesus saith unto him. Oh my, my Here's your word tonight. Amen. Come on. I am the way. Yes. I am the truth. Yes. I am the light. Amen. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. Amen. So is there a word from the Lord? There is. There is. Praise God. It's for you. It's for me. It's for them. Amen to God. It's for those listening. There is a hope. Yeah. There is a peace. Come on. It's Jesus. Amen. Brother Mike, you, you, amen to God. This ain't a salvation message. No. It's an everything message. Come he on. is your salvation. Yeah. He is your deliverer. He's your rock. Amen to God. He's your fortress. Hallelujah. He's a Come mighty on. strong tower that you run into. That's what Jesus is to me. He's my Amen. everything. Stand with me to your feet, please. Amen. Well, I hope I didn't go for too long. Amen. I want to get us out of here by 2 in the morning. Amen.
and hallelujah. <laughs> Glory to God. I just felt really strong tonight in my spirit to, to give you that. It's just a little thought I had on me. Amen. I couldn't get it off because I tell you, there's people tonight. I tell you, I, I've been one of those people. Is there a word from the Lord for me? Come on. I've been like kings of rubble. Zerubbabel, wherever his name was. Hallelujah. <laughs> Zedekiah, whatever. Lord knows. I've been there and I've wanted to hear that. <laughs> oh, Lord. It's good to have a good time. Aren't you glad we're not perfect? <laughs> <laughs> Hallelujah. Lord of mercy. But I've been like Jeremiah, though. I wanted to hear that there is a word. There is peace. <laughs> <laughs> Woo, Lord of God. Amen. Hallelujah. <clears throat> Father, be with us tonight as we depart. Get us to our home safely. Get us those of us who are traveling on the highways. Keep us safe. We plead the blood of Jesus over every, every vehicle, every person here tonight. Lord, let us lay down tonight and have the best night's sleep we've had in a long time with no worry, no strife, or nothing on our minds, Lord. In Jesus' precious name, amen. amen. amen.